Do you ever get the feeling that you're a robot? Not the Terminator kind that's a threat to humanity, or mindless drones that exist in melancholy Pink Floyd anthems and dystopian novels, but the useless, forgotten kind. The kind of robot that was put together with barely functional pieces. The kind of robot that screams factory recall and failed science experiment. The pieces I'm assembled with and the programs that have been installed in every facet and microchip of my being feel defective. I'm critical and overly perceptive, and instead of feeling like I serve a greater purpose, I feel infective, and every singed wire and cracked hard drive is reflective of what I see myself as. A broken hunk of metal draped with fluorescent caution tape and a warning, do not touch sign. It's as if every inch of me teems with fizzled out short circuits, wire upon frayed wire of anxieties and incorrect coding that flashes error, not good enough. I'm covered in dents, and it doesn't make sense that I could be loved existing as an ancient model when there are new, pristine versions that gleam in the light and leave onlookers in awe. Scratches and burn marks decorate my exterior, <laughs> and on the interior, my sad circuits are fried and inferior, riddled with inconsistencies and outdated components. And not being worthy of love is one of my greatest fears. Who wants a hunk of metal that's been collecting dust for years with mismatched knobs for eyes and dull grinding gears? Echoing in my mind, a busted analog clock with spidery hands, ticks, the decibel clicks shrinking with every passing moment as if it were a jaded metronome and I'm reminded that time is passing me by. I feel obsolete. I want to control alt delete and my systems may overload but I'd rather try until my gears scream in protest than admit defeat. There are days when I want nothing more than to hit a reset button, unscrew every bolt and sever every wire, and I'm left with a question ricocheting in my mind. How do I fix myself? I might feel like a robot, but I'm a human being, and there's something I wasn't seeing. Humans cannot be fixed with power tools. There's not an on-demand phone line or complicated manual that explains how to solve emotions. Even glamorous models are pushed aside after time, and their perfection is an illusion. So can we stop beating into the delusion that a person needs to be fixed? I've come to find that I'm not defective. And why should I feel the need to repair myself when I was never broken to begin with? Self-doubt and loathing are as cancerous as any harmful rust that eats away at our scrap metal and rots us until our robots dissolve into nothing. You may be made with scrap metal, but worthless? Forget it. That rust may try to consume you, but you shouldn't let it. I may not have been granted with a steel heart, slab of courage, or supercomputer brain. And though every kink and flaw causes me pain, it's what makes this worn out hunk of junk durable. It's proof that I survive, even if I didn't escape completely unscathed. Though we may be assembled with spare parts and our operating systems may be a tad faulty, we prove that we're not worthless lumps of metal. You are not your malfunctions. And when you feel like worthless scrap, decaying in a junkyard, or nothing close to valuable, remember that every last bit of you is salvageable. Every seemingly insignificant stitch mark is what holds the quilt together, and every spare part melds together after it comes apart, and every inch of you matters. So think of your scrap metal as a modern art sculpture, because you are a fucking masterpiece.